And we're on. Okay, so it's jumpy. I will, in a moment. Do it now. I need you in good shape. Look at that. Rutger freaking Hauer. So it's a little bit inky. Doesn't want to respond to her. What's this about? Just checking in or you need me downtown? Nah, just a checkup. No one left for you to interrogate. Sounds pretty bad. Yep, not pretty. The explosion leveled half a block. The place is still on fire. Corporate goons all over the place, securing the area. Covering your tracks, you mean? Careful what you say. This is a monitor channel. Who is this? How'd you get this frequency? Don't you recognize me? Adam? Yes. Well, what's left of me? Dad. What happened? Where, where have you been all this time? Away from you? <laughs> it's funny. Thought it would be easier. To hear your voice after all these years. But it really isn't. Come on, Adam, don't start. I really thought I could pull it off, you know? I was so close to making a difference, to setting us all free. And now it's... It can't be for nothing. It doesn't matter. Tell me where you are. I'll come and get you. Shit. Dad, for once in your life, just listen to me. 
Whatever happens, I need you to remember. You're not in control. Adam, can you hear me? You still there? Adam. God damn it. Dad? Dad. Okay, that's freaky. Matriarch, display caller ID. Displaying now. Kempinski. That's new. Matriarch, locate source of last call. Triangulating coordinates. Come on. Location established. Tenement building. Class C district. Jesus. Adam, the stacks. You just had to hit bottom, huh? Okay, that's cool. We need computers like that. Rock fucking bottom. Alright, for those of you watching, this is supposed to be a, a thriller, horror, cyberpunk kind of thing. It looks like they got Rutger Hauer and they really used it to the full advantage. And this is Blade Runner without Han Solo, is what it looks like. So, this is, okay, yeah, this is going to be some freaky shit right here, people. have to keep in mind when we don't take our meds things get real wiggy what the hell is he vacuuming Ain't he pretty? Well, apparently that door's locked. So I guess there's something else we need to do. That's interesting. You can read the posters. Okay. It would absolutely suck to get into the game just to get stuck in the lobby. So, ah. Need to get out. Easy there, Tin Man. I'm not looking for trouble. Oh, tenant.
Little tiny I'm reticle. Sort of. Name. Gotta be right on it. Last name, Glazowski. Mm. Not on the record. You're sure? Check again. Uh, Tenant. Name. Grabinski. Leon Grabinski. Tenant. Uh -huh. oh. Apartment 7. Ground floor. Through the courtyard. Turn right, turn left. Straight ahead, turn right. Yeah, I got it. Back with him forwards. Thanks. Mm. Door open. So, right, left. Right, left, straight, right. Just in case it doesn't actually show me. have to actually move the mouse. Ain't that some shit. You literally have to open the door. You have to hold it down and push the mouse. Attention citizens. Curfew is now in effect in all Class C districts. Remain in your apartments and enjoy your chosen holographic content. Thank you for your cooperation. Anybody want a tattoo? Maybe later. Always being watched. being watched. What the hell? That's some crazy shit right here. This is not a graphics bug, people. This is the actual game. This is just psychotic looking. Okay, I'm guessing all the ones with the designs over them is unopenable doors right now. said he was in seven so let's go to seven yeah that's right I remembered go figure now I gotta go through the hole in the wall interesting Alright, Gravinsky. Let's chat. What the hell?
is that a body? Let's close. Shit. Adam? Tom, have you gone? Oh, oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my. Abnormal stress levels. I have no control over this. He is. This is Lazowski, freaking out. ID six five six two one zero. Can anyone hear me? Great, fucking great. Okay then. Maybe it's not him. It doesn't have to be. Operational efficiency restored. This is Lazowski six five six two one zero. Setting up a crime scene. That's freaking nuts. I need to check the victim's compass for connections. There it is. Victim is equipped with an ID mixer. Identification not possible. Damn it. All right, so we can't figure out who the fuck he is. Check failed. Time of death about an hour ago before he called me. So it's not our son. Human blood. All right. Let's have a look around.
controlled substance 45F that are known as feed. You've never touched this, but I'll find his friggin' head in here. Oh, nope. Just some fish sticks and frozen crap. Alright, there's nothing else in here. made and so this is your apartment doesn't mean it's your apartment Okay, my synchro's out, so I don't know how often you have to take your meds, but just for shits and giggles. Yes. <laughs> Come on, where's my peeps? I need input from you guys. This is crazy shit. Okay, I'm guessing this is transmitting equipment. You gotta search everything, people. Don't play no damn games here, man. Come on, Rutger.
Hmm. Let's hack it. gave me. Let's go with the obvious. Excuse me. Well, we ain't found the code yet, so. That obviously ain't doing no good. Let's look around a little bit, see if we can find a code on this. guy was tapped into all kinds of shit, wasn't he? Bingo. Printed on real paper. An archaic for you, Adam. George Orwell's See what he was hiding. Holy shit. A glitch in the system. Okay, appears to just be a whole bunch of posters. <sighs> Let's see.
downtown inferno tragic accident or insurgent huh so apparently my son went missing HN I can manage her she's not like us she knows she's in over her head and it clearly terrifies her huh Still at the scene of an immense explosion, it tore a hole in what was left of a serene business area in Krakow. This is going to be one of those games, people, where you've got to read everything. You've got to pay attention. Whoever you are, I'm nobody special. Welcome. We're just getting started with this game. So hop on in, have a blast. Apparently somebody else did. Right in the middle of downtown. Uh-oh. We have files and documents and whatnot. Corrupted data. Corrupted data. Corrupted data. They burned these. That's what they did. Home security, hello. Somebody actually put a system on this piece of crap. This place is a dump. I've deactivated the apartment security system, leaving the crime scene. Oh no, Rutger, we're not leaving yet, boo-boo. Okay, maybe we are. Okay. Let the crime tech guys come in here and do their thing. I don't know what they're building, but it sure looks like a freaking person, don't it? That almost looks like the hair of a human head. All right. I guess I'm supposed to get out of here game is auto saving that's one of the things I like about this game already is it auto saves once you reach a certain point she auto saves the resolution is rough because of my system and because this game is just it's a fairly new game and it's really really weird if I don't junk up or at least that's what I'm calling it now if he don't take his meds on a regular basis doesn't feel right. You're still alive. I know it. Anyway, sorry. When Rutger Hauer is talking, we shut up. see is what I see, man. If there's any screen cut off, it's got to be from OBS, not from the game.
Let's give this a try, see what happens. KPD, I need to ask you some questions. Do you know what's going on? My hollow projection got cut off. Uh, I can't get a signal. The building is under lockdown. No external connection. Oh, dude, Not this thing, apparently this game gets a whole lot Shit. freakier. Sounds serious. So, uh, you wanted to ask me something? Noticed anything suspicious recently? Anyone hanging around in the hallway? No, not really. Then again, I don't really go out much. Dive in, man. Uh, Get uh, in there. You wouldn't happen to know when they're going to fix the connection. Not that it's like super important to me or anything. I just need to know. This game is nuts. I'm already freaking out about it. It's crazy. And if you're in my age range, then you remember the original Blade Runner. I'm not sure if anyone even knows we've been locked in. It might take a while. Oh, God. I mean, sure, that's fine. It's just, you know, the apartment feels very small all of a sudden. Kind of claustrophobic. Oh, I see. <laughs> well, all Is this will be posted. Here? I'm sweating something awful. Just take a deep breath. It's going to be fine. Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? I'm just going to sit here and wait for them to fix it. Can you talk to me some more? It makes it kind of easier. Great, I got to babysit this guy. Well, what do you want to talk about? Um, uh, yeah, you know, uh, Gorski the Giant was fighting Killer Cromer today. You an AMA fan? Uh, not really. Sounds like you are. Of course, I don't know who won since my projector went out. <sighs> Why are my hands shaking? You been living here long? Oh, well, I, uh, uh... It must have been at least seven or eight years. Ever had a lockdown before? Um, I don't think so. I don't remember my projector going off. Ever. Okay, this guy is, like, really... Sorry, I don't have time for this. Oh, okay. Uh, I understand. It's no problem. I'll just sit here alone. God, I'm really starting to sweat like a pig. Pro <laughs> tips, are you offering or are you asking? Hang in there. wonder if you can question the bird. This is this guy's son he's looking for. This is pretty messed up. There's obviously blood everywhere. There was a fight here. everywhere before doing the main mission well there's a lot of everywhere here I guess we ought to question the other people in the building huh okay what's with the bird KPD I need to talk to you get away from me man I got a piece on me and I ain't afraid to use it no you don't now calm down I'm just looking for some answers Oh, I know how you get your answers. I got nothing to tell you. E. E. Toon, you uh, you played this before? 
Apparently nobody's home there. There are some seriously fucked up people in this game. There are some seriously, seriously paranoid some bitches here. Hi, this is Tom. And Irene. <laughs> okay. We hope you're having a positively peachy day. Oh, we sure do. Sadly, we're not in right now. <laughs> But you can leave your message after the beep, and we'll get back to you as soon as we're home. Yay! Oh, I mean, beep! <laughs> Does anybody else out there want to shoot those people just for the sake of shooting them? Holy crap. PD, I need to talk to you. You broke it. No, you broke it. Nuh uh. Would you get these kids to shut up? I'm fucking talking here. Yeah, what's this about? Do you know the tenant in apartment seven? Yeah, there's a few videos yeah, out there, Tune. Okay, so it's a guy. Yeah, well, I've seen him once or twice. I might have a vague recollection. <laughs> Could you give me a vague description? Maybe. What's it to you? Let's not go with the police My route. Son might have been staying in that apartment. I'm trying to find him. Well, why don't you tell me what he looks like? I'll let you know if it rings a bell. You lost touch. It's been a while. Huh. Sign of the times, I guess. See, I'm a family man myself. You shut up! No, you shut up! Oh, shut man. Up. Yes. I swear, if you don't shut up, this then then... Uh, yeah, I can tell. So, can you describe him, or what? Young, probably in his 20s. Medium height, medium build. He wasn't very memorable. Let's see if he sees any, seen seen anything else. Have you seen anything suspicious around the building? Any strangers skulking around? Nah, I don't pay much attention to the other tenants. Yeah, Tune, I'll tell you, man, this, this seems like to be a hell of a game already. I mean, I'm not doing nothing but looking around and checking out headless bodies right now, but I bought this game and I saved it for this. So, upstanding citizens like you. I see it for the first time right now. Your ass. Good thing we'll be getting out of this dump soon. It's, it's pretty fucking nuts. Right? Yep, I've been working my way up. I even filed for a status upgrade. Once that goes through, we'll be moving. Hey, you remember the original Blade Runner tune? No time. Yeah, good luck with that. So far, the biggest asshole in the building has been the most helpful one. I guess nobody's home here. I don't know if this building's up to code. <laughs> Some of these definitely got nicer systems on them. So I'm wondering if the red light above the door means nobody's home.
Too bad you can't read that stuff. Oh, I will most likely me miss some juicy details, Tune. Most likely. But I kind of like to fall on my own face, you know what I mean? Let's hack it. Well, that hat worked a lot better than the last one. definitely crazy yeah I think Toon's got a handle on this better than I do this is absolutely fucking nuts this is some sick shit yeah this is where the crazy people live <laughs> so this is what they did with asylums after Please, just want to talk. Who are you? Did Chiron send you? I'm with the KPD, if that's what you're asking. Seriously? We haven't had a cop around these parts in... ever, I guess. Well, you got one now. Oh, you're a youngin'. You're gonna fucking need it. Well, listen, Tune. 16 or not. Hey, this must be your door. Uh... Find the original Blade Runner movie. Trust me. Watch it. It's old, but it's going to bring back a whole lot of this game to you, including the guy doing the main voice. Huge Rutger Hauer fan here. The guy is freaking phenomenal. Doors unlocked. Huh. Anybody going to shoot me? Spiders. Yeah, find that movie tune. Trust me, you want to see it. Fuck. No, I doubt it's in Netflix. You're going to have to dig deeper than that. It's an old, old movie. But... The guy that plays this voice, Rutger Hauer, he is the bad guy in the movie. Well, he's not really, he's the bad guy. It's hard to explain. Uh, but trust me, you want to see it. You hmm. really do. Janet left the door open. Okay, so if the janitor left the door open, where the hell? Crouch where? Back in that room? Because I can go back in there. I'm not the crouchy type. I hear a noise. I'm whooping somebody's ass.
quest denial. Well, I appreciate the heads up, Toon. I'll have to go back to that room and take another look. Does not qualify. Oh, man. This is that guy that thinks he's moving out. I feel bad for him. And there was a PC in that room. Well, Toon, hell, man, why aren't you playing this game? This guy got turned down for his upgrade. That's messed up. I hope I don't have to go back and tell him that. Mike Jaworski is dead. He's been dead for a long time. Consider this your final. Ooh, he sounds violent and aggressive. Hey, you know what? He's a vet. Apparently, they don't take very good care of him in the future either. Chiron R&D. Yeah, this guy was trying to step up. Yeah. And he's probably the one in that room, Tune, that uh, said he was, you know, filing for an upgrade and was looking to uh, move out. And they're going to screw this guy all over the place, aren't they? Hello. Of course. Two agents. Helena Novak at part 114. And Helena Nader at part 106. Both on the same floor. Jump scare. Storage space, oh six. You are right with the spoilers, man, don't worry. Just like every other game, this starts out kind of slow. So, you know, it's all good. Let's go back to that room because our buddy Toon says that it's a good move. Everybody thank Toon. Oh, there it is. Not a good idea to sneak up on me, you know. Need to get out. Let's play the dummy. I think that's going to work better. Yeah. I must have taken a wrong turn. These hallways all look the same. Hallway. Public. Office. Authorized personnel only. <laughs> Fine. You want to play that game? Police business. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I know what you are. Oh, yeah? Back during war, took one alive, sent for one of you to get into his head. Oh, coffee break. You fought in the big one. Is that why you got all this junk in you? Plasma sweep. Our convoy. Barlow. 
through Arbor. Sorry, I didn't mean to bring back memory. Yes. Man, I... Well, could you tell me about the tenant in apartment seven? Yeah, Tenant. How long has he been living there? Yeah. Maybe longer. Not good with time. You ever talked to him? Didn't get out much. None of them do. All right, Tin Man. Let me know if it comes back to you. Well, your name's different, so I tend to shorten things up. Something triggered the lockdown. Mm. Trying to get it open. Rudy and I. You think it might be the nanophage? You had any recent outbreaks? Is it a tunin? No. See, now That's you got me wondering. Long time ago. Now by the river. Let's get some info on Rudy. I don't like people wandering Rudy around. Is the robot. Multifunction service and maintenance. Drone. Don't lose it. What? Mm. Wanders off. Sometimes. Mm. Need to track manually. Well, I speak for all streamers. Tune. When we say we love you anyway. Can we lift the lockdown from the inside somehow? Or get a message out? No. Keep people in. Isolate, accommodate, alleviate. <laughs> yeah, we all know how that last one used to work. All right. I got a buddy online right. tells me I need to go back to the room, so I need to quit talking to this yeah. Access to the building. Uh, uh -huh. Assistance. Unstable. Unlocked. What I could. Thanks. You better stay here. There might be some very nasty people. Well, hang in there, Tune. If uh, nasty. what I don't get through the first hour and a half or so. We're going to be making videos of this yeah. after. It's going to post up. Look, just stay safe. Look for Gaming Gone you know Wrong what? on YouTube. Your name. I'm dead. Oh, name. Janice. Blacker. Roman God. <laughs> you know. Sorry I gave you a hard time earlier. Good to meet you. Janus. All right, let's go back to that room. Toon's got some good insight. Had to wait for it to finish saving. Open door. Open creepy wooden door. Okay. Is mom going to be all right? Voices from below. Good call, Tune. Probably because he's a butthead. 
Don't believe their lies. The plague is still out there. Oh, this is one of those tinfoil hat people. Three words, bull fucking shit. You know, that's good. I like that line. I'm going to use that line in one of my videos. Let me tell you how things really are. Unless you're one of the lucky class A fucks with a shiny set of mods, in which case you're probably not reading this. Well, at least they're smart enough to figure that out. Symptoms, fever, implant irregularities. Okay, uh, J Anus definitely <laughs> has that problem. Wouldn't you say, Toon? Erratic behavior. Great. Is this guy going to come back and try to whip my ass? Because I'd have to, have to kill somebody this early in the game. Juncture mouth inflammation. Okay. Don't panic. Don't be an idiot. Do not report it. The cleaners. That's what that guy in the room was talking about. The following message cannot be delivered to one or more recipients. Boy, how many times have we gotten that in real life? Annie. Tunin, I think you're right, man. There's an awful lot of dead in this game already. Aww. A letter to his daughter, and she never got it. Ain't that some shit? Really? That's interesting. I'm down, Tuna. Oh, dude. Thanks, Toon. I appreciate the fact that you gave me the opportunity to see somebody's naked feet. <laughs> <laughs> That's messed up. That's not his closet. That's his bedroom. Whoa. Man, that's fucked up. I say you he did. All right. All right, Toon, I'm going to ask you, is there anything about the game I need to know about? Because I really don't feel like playing a video game in a video game. You know what I'm saying? Right. I like the dining room table. It floats. All right. Now, the next question is, can we get to the other floors? That's the kicker. 
as we know we've got two people of interest on the next floor up. Come on. Okay, so we got stairs. We're on ground floor. So we want to go upstairs. Have you noticed that we have yet? Okay, that was a mind fuck. State of the art anti pollution mask. Yeah, see Kyle. See fucking Kyle with that poster. I'm with you there, there, Tune. That was some weird shit. I guess that means Hitler really did office, so. No great loss there. footsteps hey guys I can found the laundry room we can get some clean clothes That sounded like a dig, dude. Are you calling me old? No, you're right. There are a lot of old style monitors in this game, apparently. But let's be honest, they're a lot easier to fix. Dan Lazarski, KPD. Routine questioning. Daddy, who is it? Can he make the door open? When can we go out, Daddy? Go to your room, kids. Go play Runaway Galaxy. Let me talk to the man. Hello, officer. I'm Thaddeus Karski, head of the family. How can I help you? Listen, have you seen anything questionable going on around here? Apart from the usual, you mean? The usual? Well, you know, this place isn't exactly a beacon of morality. Still, we mustn't judge. Most people mean well. They're just misguided. All right, so... Everything all right in there? Did the lockdown spook the kids? Oh, no, we're fine. I do appreciate your concern, though. Okay, show of hands. Very calm. Yeah. Not worried about a potential outbreak? This guy is way oh, too calm. That doesn't concern us, officer. Of course, I hope that's not the case, for the sake of the other tenants. What do you mean, it doesn't concern you? We're all clean of corruption. 
my wife, myself, and the little ones. Clean. Oh. You're immaculates. Children of the immaculate birth, yes. You've heard of us. All good things, I hope. You called it, Toon. You know what? I'm going to tell him that everything's wonderful. Well, I've never been called to a crime scene where one of your kind was involved. That's good enough for me. Our kind? I see. Do you take offense to our way of life, Officer Lazarski? Oh, he wants to get into that conversation. No, but it must be hard on the whole family. No one said life would be easy. Do give me some more information, freak. Well, I'd have to say, no mods of any kind. That's quite a statement these days. Is it really? Is having a neural connection to the web worth renouncing your humanity? Is a body held together with screws and wires really worth the corrupted soul? Some would say there are benefits. Certainly. I know our lives will be shorter and less comfortable. But it's a price we're willing to pay for experiencing the purity of our God-given bodies. Don't get me wrong. I'm not a big fan of implants. But I couldn't do what I do without them. Yes, you carry them within you. It wasn't really a choice, you know? Oh, but clearly it was. <laughs> the world would be a better Good place call, Tune. Good call. That. Okay, you know what? I've had enough of this guy. You're not going to get preachy on me, are you now? I apologize, officer, that certainly wasn't my intent how do you make a living anyway not many jobs left that don't require some basic augmentation we're a close-knit community officer we help each other out as one should all right if you say so mr karski godspeed officer lazarski i'm gonna have to remember that guy's name something tells me i'm not done with him or his kind. All right, my synchro is still good. Oh, it's evening over there. Hell, it's practically mid-afternoon over here. Huh. Who are you, you ugly mug? <laughs> Don't worry, Tune. There's no points for grammar. The only reason I'm not screwing the pooch on this is because I'm talking instead of typing, trust me. Urban Refinement Coordinator, Sebastian Splutz. Yeah. Ready for disposal, cause of death classified, age 40. So he's, he's dirt, he's taking a dirt nap. All right, so apparently I'm getting kind of wiggy. So let me check my... See, this, this starts to go pretty fast. Yes. Sewer scene constructed. Strain level decreased. Collectible cards of the developers. So our developers are dead. 
ha 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 Thank you for the heads up tune. All right, so we need to find apartment 104. But we also need to make sure that uh, we don't miss anything. Oh. What a dump. Now see, I crouched at the noise. Oh, don't tell me that. Don't tell me that. You notice we don't have a weapon. I mean, I assume we have a weapon. We're a cop. I'm never screwed. Unless, of course, I'm locked in the shitter. Oh, oh. Rudy gonna kill me, huh? Well, I guess I'm gonna end this video with a death. So note to me, don't go in the crapper. Why is it I cannot defend myself? That's what I want to know. What kind of a cop runs around without a weapon? Do I have a chance, Toon? Nope, it's auto-saving. I'm guessing I don't have a chance. Aha. Uh -huh. Tuning. I'm not dead, man. Not yet. One oh nine. Ah, so we can't carry weapons. Interesting. Well, that looks important. I don't want apartment 109, I want apartment 104. Okay, that's on. Nobody's home in 10. Let's go to 104. Oh. <laughs> Tunes having fun.
here. I thought I was about to get exciting. All right. So where the hell's 104? Because I'm not seeing it. Okay, let's go this way. <laughs> yeah, there ain't nothing wrong with that tune. Ain't nothing wrong with knowing it too good. So 104 is back the other way. Dan Lazarski, KPD. Is anyone in there? Uh, no. Did I not hear a pretty little girl just now? <laughs> you okay? Your parents not home? No, just me. Somebody call CPD. All right, always ask them their name first. What's your name? Paulina. And you're Dan. That's right. How old are you, Sabina? 34. <laughs> Nine, you silly. So you're all alone in there? Yes. Well, not really. I'm playing with Fiesta. Your little sister? No. She's my friend, silly. From school. <laughs> no. Thanks she for the heads up, Tone. Friend. Only I can see her. Ah, uh, that kind of friend. I had an invisible friend too when I was your age. Caught in Tom. <laughs> Pieta thinks you're full of shit. Are you upset? Will you be all right? I'm. Uh, I'm scared. The lights went out. It's just a power outage. Um, uh, the building's not feeling well. No! Something is happening. I feel weird. Paulina. Stop it! I can't! It won't let me out. What's going on in there? 1074. 1074. Dude, that's some shit right there. Of course, the door's locked, so. Oh, interesting. One, oh, seven, four. Let's give it a shot. Yeah.
Tell me something super crazy. What the hell? That is, <laughs> okay, tune in. Now you're just fucking with the old guy. That is super crazy. Okay, mostly naked chick in a chair. Okay, here's where it gets weird, people. Okay, what the fuck just happened? Walked into a disco. Or a memory. So, how was it? Intense. Where the hell did you get it? <laughs> I know a guy who knows a guy. And there's more where that came from. If you finally get me that class B up. told you all know these things take time. Besides, it's more exciting this way. You rich people and your kicks.
Holy shit. Augmentation is not an option. This is some freaky shit, people. Am I outside? Oh. Dude, these aren't memories. Ooh, whales. Okay, I am no longer in control of that. So it won't let me go past this point. Gotta get to the pillars first. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn, so close. Good call, Tune. This might take a minute, people. What they do to this kid? Almost made it.
This is some mind fucky shit here, people. Okay, show of hands. Who thinks the kid's really creepy? Alright, one more breeze and we'll make a run for the next one. Suma's crouch time. Can't get through. Wins a bitch. <laughs> we'll get there. We'll get there. Love the flying whales, though. They're awesome. For the ones with buttons on them. Like that mamma jamma right there. Oh, come on. <laughs> so we're dancing around in somebody's head right now. That's pretty fucked up. Dude. You sure picked a fine time to grow a conscience. Shut up, oh no. You don't know what it's like. I can feel. That's some pretty crazy shit here, man. 
y'all are seeing this, I am inside someone's brain. Almost there. Almost there. Here's the chick whose head I'm in. Oh man, come on, come on, come on. you out. I don't know if I want you to. And why is that now? This dream is a temple where the heroes belong. The king dies. The angel dies. Let me stay with her. shouldn't be able to do this. How did you know I was in here? I learned from her. Paulina. Yeah, we need to call this little experiment done. All right. Let's end this. Let's reboot the machine. No! That would initiate a memory wipe right now. I fear it would kill me. What about Polina? She will be alone now. All alone. Please. Couldn't restore the connection. Let me take care of her. There has to be some way to help you. To pull you back into your own body. My body is dead. This is the only way. Please, you have... Pieta. Pieta. Dude, that's some freaky shit, man. Holy crap. Okay, yeah, this, this game, Observer, with the great Rucker Hauer and Bloober created it. This is a mind fuck. This is absolutely nuts. What you're seeing on the screen right now is not a glitch. This is the mind fuck that is the game. Uh, Toon heard my Darth Vader breather box. 
You know the truth now. There's a the little girl. Oh, looky there. Another developer. I am Lord Vader, but I am not your father. Just want to let you know that, Toon. Okay, so we just turned her room into a disco. It's interesting. <laughs> oh, guys, everybody out there who's watching this and not saying anything, let's give props to Tone. The kid's awesome. All right. Let's see what else we got going in this place. Luke, I am your father's brother's cousin's uncle's roommate from college, which makes us nothing. Sink resume refilled. Sweet, we can get to reload shit. Any buttons in the crapper? I would not even take a shower in that shithole. Seriously, that's disgusting. And I've showered in ponds, okay? Door's locked. Can't kick it in. That kind of sucks. Bluebird, get on that. This guy's a cop. He's not a pansy. All right. We need to go find 104. And quit dicking around with this. So my my newfound son, Toon, has informed me that we go back to the stairs. And we make a shitload of lefts. So let's do that. Don't get excited. There will be no back allowance for you. Restore the connection or reboot the system. Yes. First, we're going to jack in. Strain level. All right, kids. Did I ever check that door? Nobody's home. Nobody's home.
So I'm going to have to kill the chick, ain't I? Miss Nader, I'm with the KPD. Mind if I ask you a few questions? Mrs. Excuse me? Mrs. Nader. All right. Uh, Mrs. Nader. What do you want? Ma'am, is everything all right in there? Are you in some kind of danger? You tell me, officer. I heard the alarms go off. Are the cleaners on their way? Are any of us safe? The lockdown seems to be a malfunction. I don't think we're looking at an outbreak here. Well, I'm sure the other tenants will be glad to hear that. But not you? No, officer. Not me. Have you made any calls in the last hour? No, I have not. Could you check your compass for connections? Somebody may have used it as a proxy. I don't have a compass. No compass. I thought pretty much everyone had one at this point. Well, you thought wrong. I don't have any implants of any kind. So she's an immaculate. If you don't mind my asking, do you live alone? Yes, I do mind, and yes, I live alone. No spouse or daughter. Didn't you hear me? I said it was just me. Then why did you insist on being called Mrs.? I'm a widow. My wife died many years ago, in the plague. You're a missus, and it was Sorry your wife. To hear that. Is that why you don't have any implants? Yes. Want to see the scar tissue on my face and neck? It's quite an embroidery. The little monsters really outdid themselves. Or do I have to show you what's left of my arm? Would that satisfy your curiosity? Okay, she's just mean. Mrs. Nader, I'm just doing my job. Huh. Yes, I've heard that one before. When the cleaners took my Laura away. One of them turned to me and said precisely that. I never saw her again. Not even the body. It's like she never existed. With all due respect, ma'am, you're not the only one who lost someone to the fade. God knows I have no love for tyrants, but they're an easy target. <laughs> Is this when you tell me how we're all to blame? That's not what I... That we brought it upon ourselves. Ma'am. That we deserve the fate? Deserve to see our loved ones die? Didn't we? We jumped at the opportunity to meddle with our bodies, but we didn't ask ourselves what the price would be. Very inspiring, officer. And very hypocritical. Spare me the lecture. I will not be judged by some corporate goon. I wish you a good night. So long, Mrs. Nader. Helena Novak, it is. KPD? Anyone in there? Can you repeat that? The cop bought it. What do you want? You noticed anything suspicious recently? Anything out of the ordinary? What? I don't know. I didn't quite catch that. Dude, fix your comms, man. Fine. You've been very helpful. Good night. Yeah, he was useless as tits on a bull.
Yeah, Toon, if you get a chance, definitely Blade Runner, because this is all Blade Runner, man. I'm telling you. This is all Blade Runner. Why do all these doors open to the outside? See? What a pain in the butt. One oh run to one oh four. Hey, you, I can hear you out there. Help me, please. It's saving. Who the hell watches TV on the shitter? Seriously. Is there not like a functioning sink in this entire building? Alright, this guy's obviously... Prosthetics. Right run, sir. Oh, I heard this awful noise. What's going on? There's been a lockdown. A lockdown? No. Oh, God, please, not today. Yes, today, you asshat. Well, what's so special about today? I was scheduled to undergo a, a medical procedure. It's a private matter. I'd, ra I'd rather not talk about it. Suit yourself. Sir, I'm wondering if you've seen anything suspicious lately. Great, I'm going to have to choose to kill somebody. I haven't seen anything in over 40 years. Uh. That's your condition. I, I, I really don't feel comfortable talking about it. All right, Tune, we'll get back there. Hey, wait, I did hear something. Quiet footsteps, deliberate, heavy breathing, angry, not hiding, hunting. Hmm. Anything else? The smell. It seemed uh, oddly familiar. Reminded me of my childhood. Your childhood? Yes. My family lived outside the city with all manner of creatures. When it would rain, the smell would be similar. <laughs> yeah. It's just another day. you some questions certainly officer always glad to do my civic duty you seem pretty laid back you do know the building is under lockdown well yes but there's not much I can do about it is there I mean I'm sure the authorities are handling the situation as we speak come to think of it isn't that why you're here no, Scooter. Well, you, you might be giving the authorities too much credit. Officer, please. It's highly demoralizing to hear that kind of talk from a man of the law. Now, is there anything else I can help you with? Yeah. What drugs are you on? I seen or heard anything suspicious lately. Neighbors acting weird. Actually, I... 
did hear some noises coming from 104. Then the woman stormed out of the apartment and ran off. What kind of noises, sir? Screaming, breaking stuff. I, I didn't think much of it. I mean, those two are always at each other's throats. Ah. Happy, blissful marriage. Did you see where she went? Well, no, I didn't actually see her. I could smell her, you see. Smell her? Hmm. Don't tell me you can't. That cheap crap she pours over herself, the entire hallway reeks of it. She probably thinks it makes her seem ladylike. I see. I got it. Thanks for your help. I could hear her panting, too. Moaning like the whore she is. You did, huh? Yeah, biggest fucking cock tease you've ever seen. Always toying with me, bending over when reaching for the lock, all naked underneath her clothes. She knows I'm watching, too. She likes to make me itch, cooped up with that junky meathead. I mean, what does he have that I don't? They're all like that, you know? Fucking mongoloid bitch. Now, I hope she gets what she fucking deserves, so that she knows she's fucked up. She'll have no choice but to come to me, begging. But it'll be too late, you hear me? Too late! <laughs> I think, uh... I think I went to school with this guy. Okay. How about you shut the fuck up? Well, that was certainly uncalled for. Good day to you, officer. So, Toon, what do you think? You think I ought to go kill the woman or the kid first, or should I go down to uh, 104 and deal with main storyline stuff? Make it quick. Got to make a choice. You're going to be in here. You're going to be part of it. Main storyline it is. Oh, girl. Okay. We can do that. Anybody? Nope. Nobody's home in 103. So we'll come back to this. We'll go off the girl, I guess. All right. Let's go back this way. Man, I got to go back out in the rain. Okay. So basically, if I go to the main storyline, according to my inside source here, Now, why is it the doors sometimes don't work? All right, let's hope I can remember how to get back to her. And then get back here. Because this place is a shithole. It's a mess. Someone should really contact housekeeping. Get this shit fixed. Don't tell me I need to medicate again. Where am I? Oh, yeah, I'm about halfway down. Yes. <laughs> hey, when things start looking weird. Strain level decreased. Okay. We're back on the game. Uh... Yeah, I think so, too. All right. All right, Toon. Bright boy. Which room is the kid in? Can't remember what apartment number that, old, that lady was in. Oh, there's our little robotic buddy.
say, well, this ain't it. So you can OD on this stuff. Good to know. Yeah, I think so too. Uh, apparently I'm feeling better already. All right. Toon thinks I need to make a choice. All right, quick, quick vote. Who lives, who dies? Personally, I'm up for uh, often the older lady because, I mean, hey, she's already lived her life. The Dove Lovers Club. Sixteen-year-old female, well-trained. Okay, so this is fucked up. They, they're selling kids. That's what they're doing. Male, 12 years old, mental conditioning, very obedient. Female, 9 years old. Female, 13 years old. That's messed up, man. They're selling kids. Yeah, doves. I get it, Tune. Doves my ass. Paulina will never become self-sufficient and will require constant care for the rest of her natural life. It's all said. Just drop by whenever you're ready for another session. Buy a set of diapers on the way here and some IV cartridges, the recreational ones. You can get those without a prescription. I got the rest here. Well, this Ono guy's a piece of shit. Lying fucking cunt. I know you're there using my fucking equipment. Wow. Somebody's angry. What's with that stupid game? Let's reboot the system. She did. At least I think she did. Did I do what needed to be done? Let's take a quick look, see here. Yeah, I did it.
All right, Toon, my guiding little dove, quote unquote. What apartment was the girl in? Still can't get in there. I cannot remember what apartment she was in. Bloody hell. Let's take a look at our side mission action here. Next from this one. Okay, so this one? Oh. Was that room you tried? Well. You mean one thirteen? One fourteen is her. <laughs> What's the matter, Tune? You getting frustrated? Don't sweat it, dude. Seriously. It's just a game, man. If you could tell me what apartment number it was, I'd probably be a lot better off. Didn't make her a potato brain. Yeah, no, I didn't. I off the old lady instead, I think. But that's okay. I'd rather the kid live than the lady. They made this very maze-like, though, I will say that. Alright, well, we probably need to get to uh, 104. Take care of that little bit of business. Okay, the doors were a little annoying. I've got them in tiny little hallways. See? It's kind of annoying. Okay.
That's all right. I don't necessarily have to go to her room for this to work. I'm going to take your word about her. Right now, I kind of want to see where this is all going to go. KPD, I'd like to have a word. It's about time you showed up. What the hell is going on? Why are we under lockdown? Most likely a malfunction. I'm still looking into it. Well, you ain't working in the right places. Because I don't know nothing. Notice anything suspicious or unusual? Other than the lockdown, I mean. Well, the couple from 104 were making an awful lot of noise a while back. More than usual, I mean. The girl ran off, then it got quiet. Did you see where she ran off to? I ain't one to snoop. But judging by the footsteps. So in other words, the little girl's inside the toy to dog. The Good to know, Toon. Anything else you can tell me about them? What? The couple? Don't know them that well. The girl seems nice enough. Not sure about the guy, though. this kind of stuff happen often? You ever see a husband get violent? Nah, nah, he ain't a wife beater or anything like that. He's just messed up. Then again, ain't we all? What about the girl? Oh, she, she's a trooper. Works double shifts at Chiron to support that ex-con asshole of a husband. Hmm. Any idea what she might be doing for them? Can't be too important, or she wouldn't be living in this shithole. Explains the look on her face, though. What do you mean by that? Worn out, fidgety, jumping in shadows. Working for the corporation has that effect. I guess. He's got to know more about this guy. What can you tell me about the guy? Amir? I think he's called. He looks tough, but he's got the yellow eye, you know? Twitches like a junkie. Probably sells the shit, too. How do you know that? What, the <laughs> deal? I see him sneak around during the night. Slow down on the soda, Tone. You're gonna I end up with diabetes or something. Post, man. Anything else out of the ordinary? Anything at all? Well, other than some asshole bringing animals into the building, I'd say that's pretty much it. Animals? Yeah, I could, uh, I could swear I heard something growling in the hallway earlier. I informed the janitor, but, yeah, he'd lose the plot midway through I'll the keep that in mind, anyway. too. Thanks. It'd be very helpful. <laughs> That's new. Alright. Ladies and gentlemen. Let's do 104. Let's do 104. We are there. And this is where I piss everybody off. You ready? No, I'm not going to do that to you guys. We're going to go ahead and do this. We'll do 104. Anyone here? Why would I want to turn the fan on? That I want. Chiron Corporation ID. Low level clearance, but still valid. Junior programmer.
kitties. Oh, 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 oh yeah, that's messy. Apparently my cop, uh... Don't be afraid. I'm here to help. Yeah, apparently they are. Dispatch, this is Lazowski 656210. I got an emergency here. God damn it. Still no connection. Listen to me. The building's on lockdown. There's no way I can help you now. But I can get whoever's responsible for this if you help me find him. Try to talk. There's another way. Oh, hell, here we go again. Subject approved. Commencing neural interrogation. <laughs> oh, shit! Holy fuck, buckets. Note to self don't turn any fans on. going on man Some pretty fucked up shit. This dude's got some seriously messed up memory action going on. The 
water in this game really hates me. You're right about that. Huh. <laughs> Dude, that's some crazy shit. Oh, fuck. God damn. Woo, doggy. Get this damn thing open all the way. I don't think I can handle slamming closed on me. Ah, oh, shit. That's empty. that way. This is an absolute mind fuck. What is this endless hallway action? Just birds, just birds, just birds, just birds, just birds. Great. Guy's a dealer. Deals to people in the apartments. 987. The fuck? Seven five two. <laughs> 
Działania na nie ludzi, działania polega na blokowaniu niektórych receptorów układu przeciwkrwienia. Czyli nie praktyczne działanie dotyczy płata. Considering I have no idea where the hell I'm supposed to go at this point. What the fuck, man? I told you not to show up during the day. The floating bucket. Let's hope it's not their poop bucket. That would suck. Oh, man. This is absolutely mind fucky. back in prison okay follow the bouncing ball This is just fucking nuts, man. Hmm. 
<laughs> Second Phantom Pop can't do it. It's okay. Okay, well apparently I'm supposed to go that way because it keeps sending me around in a loop. Okay, I am in an endless loop here. Dude wasn't lying, this is deep, man. Alright, this is about a fucking nightmare here. follow the TV direction. How can I follow the TV direction? Alright, well I keep going through that door. for the door with all the power. Well, that was that one. Jesus Christ, man. Woo! Holy shit. This fucking slop again. It's not getting any better.
Yeah, pretty simple, but incredibly annoying. So he's back in prison. Some shit tastic memories. So sick of the water already. Yes. 
I was going to cut this video off, but man, this is just freaky weird shit, man. I promised y'all freaky <laughs> shit. Wow. That's just nuts. <laughs> All right, guys. I think we're still deep in his head here. Really? Cans coming out of the shitter. Floating shit. How to control f and substance 45? Hell no. All I want to know is how the hell to get out of this guy's head because this is messed up. Yes, the door's got two handles. It's hard to forget. God damn. This is going to be nuts, people. all your muscles and tattoos you were like a big wounded animal lost alone hey at least you knew what you were getting into yeah i guess i, I did, did. Guess we're getting a tattoo. Cool, I'm covered in them. This should be fun. In 
sickness and in health, forsaking all others? To have and to hold from this day forward until death do us part. Any regrets? All right, guys, as nuts as this is, we're going to call it here. This thing got really long on me, and we're going to come back. Don't worry. Shout out to Toon, buddy. You were awesome. Welcome back next time. I'll post when we're going to do it again. And uh, I need a little dose of reality, so we're going to call it a day. And we'll talk to you all later. Look forward on YouTube. Here on Twitch, find me, subscribe on YouTube, Gaming Gone Wrong. We'll look forward to seeing you. Have a good one, you psychedelic freaks.